Hello, welcome back to the Project Hercules Diaries where work has been progressing on the engine case on the timing side for the oil way drilling. So we've managed to drill and tap and spot face the two sides where the oil tank feed and return comes. So this here will take oil back to the tank after it's been scavenged from the bottom of the engine case and this one takes fresh oil from the oil tank and pumps it around the engine and the drillings for those are quite complex um, and took a bit of careful measuring expertly done by Mr Bob on the big drill over there and we're leaving that plate we've had to lift it up and down and up and down and up and down it's on the jack and it's really stretched the capacity of that rather primitive looking drilling machine so once again how does it work well those uh, have been spot faced and then tapped BSP to take these so we can put the uh, oil pipes on uh, with a fibre washer or at a later date because it's a chop and it's got to look dead smart a nice Goodrich braided hose um, to give it the right look so you can see where it's been scribed in the path of the holes inside so this is the fresh oil from the tank that comes in here along an oil way drilled across here and we need to drill down at this point here now to pick up that um, to make that that through passage so the the drilling has gone through there it goes all the way through and if you have a look you'll see that that nicely lines up there this drilling has gone through here and it should line up nicely with there which it does and then this long one has come up through the bottom which was a bit of a pain in the arse to drill and that lines up quite nicely with that one there trust me it does a bit of a pain in the arse to drill because you put this on the angle plate bolted to the angle plate over there uh, and it's end on so you're drilling down from the top here and it clogs up this hole with swarf but it's a bit of a beast to lift it off there and tip the swarf out blow it out and carry on drilling so that's been been a bit of a mission we're going to leave the drill like that because we need to drill and tap here to block up this hole um, the oil obviously you don't want the oil to run out the bottom of the engine that gets blocked up and on the inside there'll be a hole in this engine case in the bottom on the inside and that's where the oil pump would take the oil scavenge from the engine case pump it out of here back to the tank this is where the fresh oil comes in and gets pumped around the engine and that all fits with the oil pump here so these three holes, when we drill them down, line up with these three holes in the oil pump. And this is what pumps the oil around the engine. So good progress, a bit of faffing, a bit of careful measuring, careful marking out. Fingers crossed, when we drill down through here, we'll pick up this hole. When we drill down through here, we'll pick up this hole. And when we drill down through here, we'll pick up this hole. And then those complex oil way drillings will be complete that just leaves the rest of the holes around here to bolt on the timing cover. Um, while Bob's going on holiday, while he's away, I'm gonna machine this down slightly to make a bit more room for the uh, timing chain, because it's a bit close to this edge here. And also just take this edge off here with the mill because the timing chain is a bit close here and here as it goes around the sprocket. Um, but definitely good progress, definitely coming on. And I'm quite pleased that we haven't ballsed it up because the more you do, the more impact there is of getting something wrong because it's taken a lot of work to get to this place. So it's Friday now, Friday um, getting on a bit. I think it's definitely beer o'clock. Thank you for watching as always and more updates to follow.